my name is David Gingery, Product Specialist for Mobile Electronics. Today we're discussing the Configurable Control Zone software on the Rexroth RC1210 controller. The basic function of this software is to make the RC1210 controller flexible and easy to configure for many tasks needed on a machine. The software divides the controller into six separate zones. A zone, in this case, is defined as a specific group of inputs coupled with a specific group of outputs. See the color-coded schematic at the right for a representation of the different zones. Each of the zones can be independently configured for one of the following actions. Dual solenoid driver, DSD, single solenoid driver, SSD, or automatic fan control, AFC. The configuration of these zones is done with the BODOS service tool. First, let's define a DSD, SSD, and AFC, then we'll look at some examples and demonstrate how to configure a zone using the service tool. The dual solenoid driver is essentially an amplifier that takes input from a joystick, a foot pedal, or some sort of potentiometer, and then drives two separate solenoids. Typically, the solenoids are attached to a pump, a motor, or a valve. The first solenoid drives the output in one direction, and then the second solenoid drives the output in the opposite direction. The input is typically scaled from minus 100 to 0 and then 0 to 100 percent. Similar to the dual solenoid driver, the single solenoid driver is essentially an amplifier that takes input from a joystick, pedal, or potentiometer and then drives a single solenoid. Typically the solenoid is attached to a pump, a motor, or a valve. The solenoid drives the output in one direction and the input is typically scaled from just 0 to 100%. The automatic fan control can monitor several different temperature inputs, either resistive or J1939 CAN messages, to proportionally control the speed of the cooling fan. Using time ramps, you can configure how quickly the fan responds to change in the requested fan speed. In our first example, we show a couple of typical applications for a single function machine. The first is a concrete mixer. In this example, we've set up zone one as a DSD to control the drum rotation. The second is a street sweeper. In this example, we set up zone one as a DSD to control the broom. In our second example, we show two machine applications with multiple functions. The first is a road roller. In this example, we set up zone 1 as a DSD to control forward and reverse, and zone 2 as a DSD to control the steering left and right. The second machine is a loader. In this example, we've set up zone 1 as a DSD to control the valves that control up-down functions, and we set up zone 2 as a DSD to the valve that controls the bucket dump functions. Our last example shows a couple of multi-function machines that also have a fan drive on the machine. We are using the first three zones to control various functions on the machine, and then zone six specifically to control the cooling fans. The GoTo program is a rapid delivery program to help you get the parts you need when you need them. GoTo has all the mobile electronics parts you need to assemble and connect to a control zones project, most times in less than two business weeks. See your local distributor for details. So, how do you get started? I have a simple one, two, three diagram to show you exactly what you need to order and how it all fits together. So let's get started. Step one is getting the hardware connected to your machine. Let's start with an RC1210 controller. Then you need two connector kits that plug into the controller. Next are the wire kits. These kits come with a contact pin already crimped on the wire, so you simply plug them into the connector kits. The ground and power wires. Next, the signal wires. After that, you just need CAN high and CAN low wires. And the last thing you need is a BODOS service node cable to connect the CAN wires to the CAN adapter in step two. Step two, the CAN USB adapter and the BODOS service tool. Step three is loading the BODOS software and CAN adapter drivers. That's it. After loading the service tool, be sure to select the appropriate adapter and language under the tools menu. 
The BoatOS service tool has many features to help you fine tune and troubleshoot your machine. But in this video, we'll only use the first two, flashing and configuring parameters. Flashing the zones software into the controller is a simple process. First, select the flash tool in the lower left corner. Second, select the CAN standard protocol in the upper left corner. Third, browse and select the hex file for the zone software. Fourth, select the RC1210 controller in the drop-down list. Fifth, click the start button to begin the flashing process. And lastly, cycle the power to the machine before the blue bar at the bottom disappears to the left. After the control zone software is loaded, the last step is to configure each zone, which essentially consists of the zone function, the outputs, and the inputs. To configure the zone parameters, we'll be using the Diagnosis portion of BODOS service. First click the Diagnosis tab, then click Scan for Controllers button in the middle of the screen and click to accept the license agreement. Once the service tool is connected to the zone program, click Parameter, then click Zone Configure, and then select the desired function. Next, using the drop-downs, configure the solenoid types for both A and B outputs. If needed, select the zone ramp to adjust the faster or slower speed. Finally, if an analog input is being used, select Input Cal to calibrate the input. However, select CAN Joystick and set up the node ID for a CAN Joystick input. At this point, you're ready to click the Save button at the top of your screen with the green check mark and the parameters will be saved to the controller. Please note, there are many settings that we didn't mention in this video that will allow you to fine tune your machine. Please see the manual or software description for more details. Finally, if you have any questions, feel free to contact me at david.gingery at boschrexroth-us.com. Thank you.